Hello guys, welcome to your fourth C++ tutorial. Uh, in this video, we will learn about conditional statements in C++. So, syntax for conditional statements in C++ is like this. If this condition is true, then the code written inside these brackets will be executed. And in if else statements, if this condition is true, then the code written inside these brackets will be executed otherwise uh, if this condition is false then the code written inside this bracket will be executed and in else if statements if this condition is true then the code written inside this bracket will be executed and if this condition is false then it will go and check this condition and if this condition is true then the code written inside this bracket will be executed otherwise uh, it will go further 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 till the n minus 1th condition and if all the conditions are false then uh, then the code written in these brackets will be executed so what we have to do in this problem is we have to input a integer if the uh, if the input integer is in between 1 to 9 then we have to print English word corresponding to the number that is if the input number is 5 then we have to print 5 f 5 e 5 and if the input number is 8 then we have to print e i g s t 8 uh, and if the number is greater than 9 then what we have to do we have to print greater than 9 okay so let's try to solve the problem first we will declare an integer variable then we will take input and if n is equal to is equal to 1 then we will print o n e 1 as if n is equals to equals to 2 then we will print 2 and as if n is equal to is equal to 3 then we will print 3 and so on till 9 and if all the above conditions are false that is the number is greater than 9 then we have to print greater than 9 ok so let's try to run our code so it passed the sample test cases now we will submit our code so you can see it passed all the test cases so so thank you for watching and please subscribe the channel for uh, notifications of upcoming videos thank you again.